Hi everybody, today I am going to talk about one of the important things that we do while writing, which is transitions. What do we mean by transitions? Transitions are the connectors or the linking words that we use in order to connect our sentences, to write a paragraph or to connect paragraphs in order to write an essay. The first question that uh, may arise is how to connect sentences in an essay or why should we connect sentences in an essay? The first reason is to establish relationships between sentences. What do we mean by relationships between sentences? Is it a relation of addition? Is it a relation of concession? Are you going to give an example? Are you going to explain? So these connectors establish the relationship between sentences. Number two, the second reason is to shift smoothly from one idea to another idea. So these transitions make uh, us move from one sentence to another sentence, from one idea to another idea, in order that we can write independent sentences from each other. The third reason is to warn the reader about what is coming next. What do we mean by this? So, for example, when you say, when you write or you make a connector like that is, your uh, reader will understand that you are going to, to explain. When we use, however, your reader will know that you are going to use uh, an idea which contradicts the previous one. When you use in addition or also, your reader will understand that you are going to add similar opinion or similar idea. Of course, these uh, connectors warn the reader about what is coming next. Number four, to set coherence and cohesion. What do we mean by coherence and cohesion? Coherence means that you are discussing your point of view in a, as a unity and cohesion means that you make a glue between sentences and between paragraphs. The second uh, thing or component of your writing is that makes it good is the variety of transition words. So number one why we, sh we should vary our transitions, which means use different transitions, don't repeat the same one. Number one, to avoid repetition. If you have repetition in your, if you, in your writing, your writing will be weak. Number two, to enrich the composition. So you enrich your composition by this variety of transitions. Number three, to make the essay interesting. So your essay is interesting when you have different transitions. It is interesting for your reader. Number four, to establish an effective interaction with the reader. So the reader will follow you, not just as a, so someone who receives as a receiver, but someone who is going to use his mind to think or to reflect your ideas. Now, let's move to some uh, common linking words that we use in order to connect our sentences. You have linking words of addition. You can use and, also, as well as, moreover, furthermore, in addition, additionally. Comparison used similarly, likewise, in the same way, equally. Concession we use, however, although, yet, but, still, despite. Contrast, whereas, in contrast, while, conversely. Reason we use because, since, as, due to, thanks to. Result, as a result, hence, therefore, thus, so, consequently. Examples we use, for example, for instance, such as like. Conclusions we use connectors like in brief, 
in short, to summarize, in conclusion, all in all, to conclude, on duhur. So, those connectors, when you use them in your writing, your writing becomes more interesting and good, and your reader will be, of course, understanding whatever you said, because the transitions are very important in any writing. So, they are important not just to connect the uh, sentences within a paragraph, but, but also to connect to the paragraphs within an essay. So, to start your body, you can use connectors like indeed, in fact, well. If you want to use a, a contract, contradictory ideas we use expressions of contrast if you want to add you use expressions of addition if you want to give example you use expressions of giving example if you want to give your opinion you give expressions of giving opinion and so on so those transitions are very important to make your writing coherent thank you for watching